Welcome to this week's Record Wrap and here's what's been happening across the South Pacific. ANZ Stadium in Suva was packed last Sabbath as more than 10,000 people crowded in to hear General Conference President Pastor Ted Wilson. The full day program included a free breakfast and a mission focused afternoon program, while a special offering collected nearly 80,000 Fijian dollars for projects around Fiji. During his time in Suva, Pastor Wilson also officially opened the church's new centre of influence and launched Hope Channel Fiji onto its new digital free-to-air platform. Fiji was the last stop on a busy six-week world tour and Pastor Wilson and his wife Nancy are now back home for the holidays. Pastor Darren Garlett has been named the new Director of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander Ministries for the Seventh-day Adventist Church in Australia. Previously the Ministry Coordinator at Mamarafa College and National ATSIM Advisor, Pastor Garlett is the first Indigenous Minister to be appointed as National ATSIM Leader. He was also one of the first students enrolled to study at Mamarafa College in 1997 and was among the first to graduate two years later. Pastor Garlett begins his new role in January. Sydney Adventist Hospital has installed world-leading robotic technology designed to provide more precise surgery and faster recovery time for patients. The $2 million machine will enable life-saving procedures through small keyhole incisions in a patient, with Dr Stephen Pillinger, head of robotic colorectal surgery at the SAN, saying the new robot is groundbreaking. And finally, the Seventh-day Adventist Church on the small island nation of Kiribati has big plans to reach others with the gospel message. The Trans-Pacific Union Mission is building a 500-watt FM radio station on Tarawa Island in the Kiribati Mission, one of the poorest missions in the South Pacific Division. Volunteer Project Manager Pastor Colin Dunn says Hope Radio FM Kiribati will be able to reach 60% of the 100,000 citizens of Kiribati, where the church has historically struggled to find a voice. That's it for this week's Record Wrap. I'm Maritza Brunt. God bless and have a great weekend.